Hello and welcome to episode 8 of the Lady Night series. There are more episodes on my channel and other series as well, and if you're after adult content or you just want to support the channel and help make these videos possible, there's a link to my Patreon down below. Please leave a comment, I love hearing from you, and as always, I hope you enjoy. I think we're done for today, don't you? We can stop here, make a camp, relax. The horses will enjoy a good rest. No, I know we could reach the castle by nightfall, but I don't want to. <laughs> we can knock on their gate at around noon tomorrow instead. That'll be easier than getting there in the dark. I know it's right there on the hill. I can see it just as well as you can. But it's still a half day's ride away and I want one more afternoon, one more evening, just out here. Because I've been behind a lot of walls lately and they're starting to make me itch. I suppose I can still see the stars inside walls. <laughs> That's a very good point, girl. Look at you being all philosophical. It means um, having deep and interesting thoughts about the world. You do? No, you're not dumb. You're uneducated. There's a difference. I do say so. Because I'm older and wiser than you, whether you believe that or not. Come on. We can go bathe in the river like the savages we are. Oh, you need so many reasons today because I feel grimy and frankly quite disgusting. So I imagine you must feel the same way, even if you're not willing to admit it. And we should probably at least try to make a good impression tomorrow. Female night, you know, heaven forbid we don't make a good impression. I don't know, maybe I just want to see you take your clothes off. Is that a better reason? Besides, it's one of my favourite things. Well, all I can see is grass, a few trees and a castle on a hill. There's not much else to do for the rest of the day. Can you blame me? I have other favourite things. I have lots of favourite things, like a good steak and mushroom pie with a cold beer. I know, right? I'll be thinking about that for days now. I love riding Edgar at a full gallop for miles. I love when you're asleep and you're dreaming, because it's funny. No, your nose scrunches up as if you're concentrating very hard on something and it makes me wonder what you're dreaming about. It's not creepy to watch you while you sleep. Well, I thought you'd find it romantic, but clearly not. Oh, just teasing, uh-huh. Sure you are. Hm. Get in the river. Because you smell. See? You're staring. It's not just me that's getting a kick out of this, so don't bother trying to deny it. Oh, we spend far too much time together for me to not notice all of your little quirks, girl. Well, maybe I observe you more than you think. And not just when you're asleep. Because you're easy on the eyes and I enjoy watching you exist in the world. It makes me happy. What? What? What was that for? You're a strange creature, you know that? Well, if you're going to start kissing me, you could at least carry on. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> hmm. 
I'll help you wash your hair. Well, you complain about it enough, I figure I would be nice and help fix it. And then I don't have to listen to you complain anymore. Am I not allowed to be nice to you all of a sudden? Well, no, I fully expect you to pay me back later. Since when do I do anything for free? Hmm? <laughs> Lean back. Let me rinse your hair. You, madam, need a haircut. Because it's getting entirely too long. Look at this, it's ridiculous. Oh, you're so precious sometimes, you know that. I won't cut your hair in your sleep. God knows what you'd do for revenge. Hmm. <sighs> I don't know what we'll do if we find this princess. I need more information. Well, did she run off by herself or with a lover, perhaps? Did she have help from within the castle or from without? Who might know where she's gone? Does anyone know where she's gone? Why did she leave? Why has she run away before? Where has she ended up before? What destinations should we look into? What ones should we rule out altogether? Yes, there are a lot of questions that need to be asked. Which is the main reason we need to make a good first impression, or at the very least, be clean and presentable. We want people feeling comfortable enough to talk to us. Well, that's where being women comes in handy. Or folks might think we're more approachable and be willing to talk. Or, at worst, they'll think we're stupid, but if that's the case, they're likely to let information slip that they wouldn't with a man. You're just as much a weapon as your knife girl. You've just got to learn how to wield yourself properly. It's not about whether I think the job will be easy or hard or dangerous or safe because there's just no way of predicting how a job will go. Something simple can turn complex and something seemingly free of danger can turn into an absolute shit show. It's best to not expect anything but be prepared for anything. Yeah, that's exactly all right. What? I'm just looking at you. What's wrong with looking at you? I've not gone soft. No. Your tits are out in a river. It's pretty much impossible to not look. <laughs> or should I be doing more than just looking? Is that it? Do you need more attention than I'm giving you, girl? Is that what's wrong? Hmm? I've already washed your hair for you. Do you need help washing elsewhere? Oh, poor thing. I've been spoiling you if you need this much help. Hmm. Is that what you're after? You needy little thing. My fingers down there. Yes, I thought so. Well, how am I supposed to help you if you won't spread your legs wider? Seem much better. Hmm. 
You're very selfish, you know. You are. I should stop helping you altogether. Oh no. <laughs> or maybe I need a little bit of help getting clean as well. It would be considerate is all I'm saying. Oh, don't throw my words back at me. That's just cruel. Wicked thing. There you go. Is that wide enough for you? Ah. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Are you all right? <laughs> no, it's not just you. <laughs> it's it's really very cold in this river, so <laughs> we might have to reschedule. No, it's all right to laugh. It's funny. Oh, girl, it's not supposed to go smoothly every time. Where would the fun be in that? Oh, okay, come on off of this uneven riverbed we'll get dry get a fire going get dinner cooking and then we will revisit this in more comfortable circumstances how does that sound